you the steadfast in this year and the remaining days of your life you shall know no evil there in jesus name In the name of Jesus, you shall receive the miracle of sound health. Great thanks, enormous thanks. A thanksgiving that cannot be described is worthy to be given unto God who has given us the grace of this Holy Spirit meeting. Kishefu iwo ati emi nikan ni Olorun ton fi ipade yi sanu fun It is not only you and I alone that God through this mission has mercy on us O fi sanu fun ara aye He also have mercy on the world through it Gbogbo kan ti sin be ni ona igbala yi Christendom yi na ni and we also use it to have mercy upon all the people that are on, the, on this way of Christendom. Your heart ought to give thanks. That you are able to do the way you are doing today. Njeki alafia Jesu Kristi lati onwa kobali agboyi Therefore may the peace of the Lord Jesus Christ from heaven descend upon this fold You know iwe ere Johanu ni mo tin soro ni chapter 20 The man of God is talking in the gospel according to John in chapter 20 after our Lord Jesus Christ had died and resurrected, we all know that there was one person that he first appeared to. Mary Magdalene. Mary Magdalene. After that, he appeared unto Peter. After this, he appeared unto ten disciples that gathered together. Be what if you do come by Immediately they saw him. Alafia ni okokogbe sinu aguara wo sinu aye wo. It was first peace that he planted into their body, into their life, into their heart. Nephi 21, 
and also in verse 21 he also called upon peace into their ministry and their gathering. All the worshippers in Christ's covenant church In Jesus Christ throughout the world. May the peace of God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, through the Holy Spirit, in always from heaven descend upon you. May your peace, may your chest and heart receive comfort and peace. All the pregnant women in this ministry all the babies and the children the peace of God and that of Jesus Christ his son through the Holy Spirit may it descend down into the life of each one And no more things that cannot be quantified. Is worthy to be given to God and Jesus Christ is Christ. Christ Covenant Church. Christ Covenant Church. That Christ Covenant Church is still Christ Covenant Church. That I gem is still existing as I gem. That still you are a living being. You have been made to progress further in faith. Great and animal thanks be unto God. The one who is using the blood of Jesus Christ his son to have mercy on us. May the thanksgiving of the man of God go and ascend into heaven right now. Now you have gone to the juncture that we are going to say a prayer together. John chapter 20. That same book of John chapter 20. million, billion, trillion years. That's your world, The incident or the occurrence of over 20 trillion, 30 trillion years away upon the elect. Can reoccur again. Oh, she, she, kibi, oh, she, she, le, nigba, na, koya to die. But it is possible that the way through which it happened that other time may be a little bit different. La iti, yes, o nwa, toti fi ala, fi a, fu a, wo me, ye. After Jesus Christ, the Lord, has pronounced peace upon his followers. He gave it to them. He handed it over to them. He distributed it to them. He commanded it for them. 
After a little word of admonition. The Bible told us that after he has said all of these things, he preached unto them and tell them to receive the Holy Spirit. Because he wanted them to do the will of God, that the light of God, just as the way he himself had done. It just yeah, key one. of which you too should make effort and determine to abide and accept. To do the work of God. The man of God does not ask you to come to the podium like this. But to your body, in your neighborhood, to the name of the Lord, to the church of God and the servants of God. He wants you to be like him. That's why he breathed unto them. And screamed. And because he called the Holy Spirit into them. It's not out of deceit. out of deceit out of noise or out of deception. Just like the habit of some other people. So that you can be like Jesus. So that you can do the work of Jesus. So that you can believe his word and you will be able to do according to the will of that word and desire of that word from you. You are going to raise your voice unto God in the name of Jesus very well. Oh God, Inspire me for good. Revive and breathe into the each part of my body. Breathe on and revive your church in this world. Christ Covenant Church. Breathe in and revive each of your world that shall be saved. That will be coming out into my body, into my hairs. Don't let us take it or receive it contrary to Revive and breathe on to my prayers, to our prayers. Lord, breathe on to my sleep and revive my sleep and my dreams. Breathe on my family. Breathe upon my business and my work. All the places where my children are all over the world. You are there. Breathe upon them. Revive them so that they can prosper in all that they are doing. Above all. Above all. 
Le se share ti won si file se bi iwo Jesu gangan Oh God give me the true Holy Spirit that will help me to do according to your word and according to the heart of Jesus Christ Mo fe ni gba ti pinu ajinde si ye ti o ni pegun I want to partake in the accession into heaven and have everlasting life Mo si fe ni eto si gbo gbe iyanu ati ibukun I want to have right to all the blessings that you have for me, that you have determined for Don't me, Lord. For me, 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 Oruko Jesu Christi Oluwa wa in Jesus name our Lord Ni Oruko Jesu in Jesus name Ope mi o to bi opo 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 fun gbogbo rere ati anu re The thanksgiving of the man of God is great and anonymous and big for all your goodness and mercy. Mosi muto wow. And the man of God has brought it unto you. Jeulua. Therefore, O oh Lord, Iwaloni agbore. You hold your hold. Iwalosi ni ajoko kanto bekale. And you own each feast that you have established. All the souls that are joined together with this meeting all over the world. Ba, ba. Father. For good in this meeting. Oh God, revive us. Our faith, revive it. Baba, Each one of us, oh Father, pour out your spirit into our lives. Through that word. Through the blessing. Baba. Father. Fulfill your will from our hands. Lord, Jesus Christ, Oluwawa. In Jesus' name, our Lord. Ejekala juka juko. Let us open our eyes and have our seat. Can you see this one more time? Ma, that you pay a long coda be any canny. Lano layeta be sadele. Suma be allowed to carry a gun. New doll. God has not created you like anyone in heaven on earth or under the earth but he has created you in his own image in his own likeness be on tiri losi fekiori and the way he is is the way he desires that you also become be on tiri and who he is is the way that he wants you to be. Many of the things that God does not have regard for, he also desires that you don't have regard for them. And many of the things that God value that He regards, He wants you also to regard and value them because He has created you in His own image and likeness. Oh, 
Ogarun gbekele o ki wo shiro bi o tin shiro God rely upon you that you should look and estimate the way he does ko ye ki o gbo ti eniyan iru en ti ba je du ti olorun lo you ought not to hear anybody no matter who the person may be more than god ko ye ki o tele iman re ki wo si yapa si mo ti olorun you should not follow your own counsel and you will go against the counsel of God Tori ima Olorun ati afojusun Olorun ko dabi ti ti wo me niyan because the counsel of God and the focus of God is not the same as a focus on the, on, on, on that of you of son of man Imare lori on kokan ati afojusun re lori on kokan your cancel or your focus on each thing and on everything papa lori ijo olorun especially on the church of god ni pataki julo bi o ti fe ki osin more importantly how he want you to worship him the salvation of your soul ibuku ti e ki oni the blessing that you ought to have iyanu ti e ki ori balaye yi ati na yitin bo the miracle that you ought to receive in this earth and in the world to come iru imati wo ba ni whatsoever knowledge understand you may have whatever teachings that you might have passed through whatever power that may be in your kids any land or any country wherever you are sojourning on earth imare afojusun re ko le dabi oyi ti olorun lori ijo re your focus and your counsel or your thought can never be like the thought of God and focus of God on your own health and even on the church of God. Therefore, oh yeah, kill both. Shall I run duty in your bubble? You hear, you, you need to hear, or you ought to hear God more than anybody else. Didu, didu ni ona lono. The word of God is sweet. Ona la afi ni ona lono fu akare fu ilare. And the way of God and the way of the word of God is peace for you and for your health. Fu ibujoko re. For your marriage, for a mirror, for your spirit or your life. Kosi balara nino imalaru ati afoju sunre si ofin lo just in ko ni pase mare. There is no heart in the focus of God and the counsel of God, which is showing you, which is teaching you through His Spirit. Even though the powerful nations of the world rose up against a set of children of God like you, like me. I want sign dream. I want Allah Bajula, Lord Lady. No, the sign dream, the eye authority in that land. The act of Apostle chapter five, verse twenty-nine. In Acts of Apostles, chapter 5, in verse 
oye ye awon iran se olorun yi awon omo olorun yi pe awon ko podo ma gbo sorun ju ti eyan lo the people of god and this people of god had the understanding that they ought to obey god than any other man ashe won logo they were glorified amor awon duro their ways were established olorun pinun lati mu iman re duro god desire to also establish your counsel All the things you are afraid of. All the things that you are applying different kind of tricks as if you don't have God. Remember that God has created all things. Imare lati mu on gogoduro o si dara is desire and thought to uphold all things is good mo sa ko lo mo bishop okan re emi re ati aye e lowo mo do you not go astray away from the bishop of your soul and the bishop of your life pada si nu ima Return back to the counsel and to the wisdom of God. Return back to the power of God. And may the grace of God and the peace of God increase on you in all your ways awon ti o gba jesu ni oluwa to rugbara the people who believe jesus christ as the lord and savior If they have the power to speak to their heart, to their spirit. To redetermine or to think over their mind over and over again or from time to time. And they are worshipping under the word of God, which is the counsel of God. And they are subjecting their heart under the bishop of their soul, who is Jesus Christ through the Holy Spirit. Even though they may not see him physically, after all, there are ways that we see him. Many of the at times you slumber, you sleep, and you dream. And you believe that it is God that is behind it. Whereas, the dream will go to oblivion. And many at times, God does not know about these dreams. But you cannot find the secret behind it. You put your mind to it. You are putting it in your mouth. You are even praying about it. You are expecting the fulfillment of it. You are also finding and paying the way. And consider the word that is even expressly to you that you even found the foundation of it in the Bible. Speak to your heart. Do not go in your own counsel anymore. Do not follow your own nature anymore. 
Amo nkan ti ohun wo to n je ki omo act sluggishly things that you are looking at that you are considering that are making you to act sluggishly si bo bo ikirare ati ase re to all his instruction and all his warnings that is making you to think again and again and again. At the back of time, you are wasting time on it. Consider a visitor that you ought to see from afar off and begin to scream. Sure, but you to the Lord, You know, when you have an August visitor, you are also going to show it the way you react. Oh, to you. you also have the understanding so. But because how that August visitor is enormous and big, oh, enormous. you always scream consider when your child returns from a journey. Oh, Compared to visitor, not that we have not seen the person that we just ask the child oh, you are welcome. that sometimes they even ask us don't you see the person who just arrived and say I've seen him welcome our forefathers in faith they don't follow their own vain thought their own vain mind and their own mind. Once God speaks, they don't waste time. They quickly turn themselves to that word. Consider how it is. God taught Abraham that which he should be. Because of what is in between him and Lot. Between the headsmen of Lot and the headsmen of him. God appeared to him. And subject the heart of Abraham. And taught him that which he should say. Do not forget that little child of the other time. Who have lost his parents? Tafi, if I can see that we show love to you. Ti o ti gbagbe ibere re. Now has forgotten its beginning. Who fail to now remember its source? Oh, to what that boat is about you? Now it has now grown. Abraham move your own now, Lord, Lord. Abraham entreats God on this message. God always speaks to the people and lead the people who do not always follow their own vain thought, their own vain mind, and the vanity that human beings are telling them. Genesis chapter 13, verse 8. In Genesis chapter 13, in verse 8. Abraham was with full out of bed, and maybe all. Must Jackie go along as a car and me at tea, right? Atlantia went down and down and me at down and down and there. Into the bay, Alania, Waja. And Abraham said unto Lord, Let there be no strife, I pray thee, between me and thee, and between my headsmen and thy headsmen, for we be brethren. Abraham 
lati si gboju re so ke o si wo gbogbo agbegbe jerani pe oni omi ni ibi gbogbo gege bi ogba oluwa bi le egypt ni apa sorry eyi ni pe ke oluwa to pa sodom ati gumura run be ni lo ti yan gbogbo agbegbe jerani fun ara re lati si ni lo si ha ilorun be ni won ya ara won abraham si joko ni ile kenani lati si joko ni ilu agbegbe afonifoji na o si pa go re ni titi de sodom Verse 12, from verse 9 to 12. Biki Bajakbe Abraham ni oro Lord ti nbe inu re. Adi bin Abraham did not have the word of God. Oya ko ki egun mole ko ki epe mole. He ought to start cursing. Oya ko si ki regun mole. And he ought to start cursing the child. Sugbo soro bi Olorun ti nsoro. But he spoke like the way God oh, no, 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 no. he thought the way God would think and there was peace it was after this that Lord was taken captive Abraham took his people to go and rescue him the wisdom of God is Far beyond the understanding of men. And the counsel of God is far much more than that of the world. If you can show yourself as he who is Christ, the man of God knows that you are a human being. And he knows that our nature and our way and habit is not the same. Oh, until see, And the challenges that everyone is facing in his house, in his work, in his place, even in the church of God, is different. But it is the word of God that can perfect us all together and even make us reign together with Jesus Christ. Can you see? This one more time. You ought not to be wise and use your nature because you are you are a woman and because you are a man. You ought not to be wise your own <laughs> side because you are a youth or you are an adult. Maybe because you are rich, but in case you are powerful or not. Because after you have believed. All the sins you are committing, many a times there are no more forgiveness for them but for you to go to their judgment. Maybe in the church of God or maybe in the world. Maybe in your family. Or even to your own self. First John chapter 5, verse 21. And your mommy, a para anima quoni no orisha. That's why the book of First John chapter 5, verse 21 has told us, and he said that all you, my children, save yourself from adultery. I want to tell you, fellatisheni. The idols, things that the world desires to do. 
that the people in the world do not regard because God has not counted them together with himself like you he has not shown them the, his, his salvation he has not even handed it over or give it to them but you God determined salvation concerning you he showed it to you and hand it over to you he not even brought you closer to himself consider the effort of God upon you he speaks to you one on one when you read the word of God alone when you are reading the Bible, a spirit of God is witnessing for the glory of God and the word of God in your life. You have the Holy Spirit. Consider the years that we've asked over and over and we have received. But you are always proving stubborn. Oh, tell me, I'm about sorrow. You don't follow the spirit even though it you. But immediately he sees that you desert it and you don't follow his counsel and it is a counsel of men, the counsel that human beings are giving to you and your own counsel and your way is what you had followed. Our first left, we hear it He will now leave you for your reprobate mind. Oh, my baby, we buy a bar for us. What for? Unless you can go in Nigeria. For he knows that if the whole world joins together, a sinner will not go unpunished. Lie it, he. Oh, the read that read this. I do ba. After you have received the first forgiveness. Shalalu, Timoni, Omare. And God has enlisted and know you as his child. Oh, yeah, keep one of Timoni. Be your name, Timoni. You ought to be walking the way he works. Think the way he thinks. Because you also know, as it's written, that vengeance is mine, the Lord said. As elect, <laughs> nobody can do evil to you and can go scot free. What? See. What are you oh, here? Ma. Or not? Oh, you don't? Oh, or not? Oh, Even if the person <laughs> thought about it, <laughs> God who has counted you with himself will revenge for your <laughs> cause. That is what Abraham knew and Abraham did not even disturb himself. <laughs> because he expected and was hoping for peace all the time like he who has called <laughs> Abraham. Because he who has called Abraham is a God of peace. He has said, vengeance is mine. He said, do not sin and you are sinning. You that you are in one fear or another. On your child or wife. On your pregnant and on your your On your business, on your business. You are freed in the power of the Holy Spirit. All the point where you are hoping and expecting for miracles and help from my boy. In the name of Jesus, may God fulfill them for you. This Holy Spirit meeting. Two signs from heaven follow it for you in all things. Through this meeting, God has chosen you as his witness. 
In your faith. In your life. In your family. May you become that good witness in this time in the name of Jesus Christ. to this message very well and put your heart to it. It is good for you to the voice of the keeper of your soul, of your life, more than yourself and more than that of anybody. You, you are looking for and you are open for all different kinds of the help of God. And your matter is liking to bitter leaf and sugar cane. It's the same land that we have planted the bitter leaf that we also planted the sugar cane. But you can hear the testimony of people concerning the And the testimony you are hearing amidst us is not even one ten percent of what God is doing amidst us. Why is it and what is the cause? That many of those testimonies are not from you. Oh, yeah, Jesus Christ. You confess Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior truly. But you have hindered his likeness. We are asked, God has created you in his image and also in his likeness. Many of the things that you ought to know, you don't know. And many of the things you ought to accept, you fail to accept. We see you physically like this. But his eyes follow every one of us. So that you can receive the fullness of joy from him. So that his help can come upon you and your household totally for this word but also so that he can count you worthy in his kingdom number three and so that you can also be useful for many other people and for his holy name to do the work of he that sent you You need to receive this Holy Spirit into your heart. The man of God will make this analogy because we want to pray. At the bulk of time, a woman that has no husband yet committed. or who is not yet committed to her husband. Do you know that anybody can woo her or speak to her? Of a two she has determined what she, kind of man she wants. The kind of man she needs that she wants. Do you know that after you have gone into a covenant with someone who has not divorced you, 
And you are not also ready for a divorce. One. Number one. There are places that you ought to be found in. Two. Two. There ought to be a, a kind of relationship that should be between you and any other person. Three. Number three. There are even there is a certain kind of way that you should be dressing. Four. Four. There is a kind of way of a manner of talking that you should have between you and someone that you have accepted as your husband that is a covenant between you. So that you will not be likely to someone else. In the sight of your husband alone, but also in the sight of many other people. Likewise, is also for a child of God that God has called, that God has chosen. There is a way that you should dress, and there's a way that you should do to your body. Nobody asks you not to wear clothes or wear wristwatch. Or wear shoe, but rather see what the epistle of Peter says. There is a companion that should be found in and relationship that you should have with people. There is a kind of community or congregation of people or companion that you should have or you should be found in. There is even a kind of thing that should be going through into your mouth. There is even a way that you should be working in your life for your life to show its glory and receive its blessing furthermore. Likewise, it is for every elect. Because we cannot be in sin and say the glory of God shall abound. At the back of time, you seek, but you don't find. You ask. But you do not receive. First John chapter two. In First John in chapter two. Verse 6 says, He that said he abide in him unto himself also to walk even as he walked. Don't allow the counseling or the counsel of man to turn you to an enemy of God. Don't cancel yourself on the service, on the work of service, on the church of God. The servant of God. Do not cancel yourself beyond the way God is canceling you. Because your focus your counsel can never be like that of God upon his thought. Never. 
your focus in your life upon your life, life. even physically in this world is not even like that of God. You came into the world If one, if one could know that one is going into the world and even know the family that one will be giving birth to or the family that one is going, it's possible for one to change it. When there are better ba, ibi ti want ibi countries, better developed countries everywhere in the world, would one now go to a place where one was given birth to? Orile de kan wa fun bi osu meji meta ninu odun kan orun ti e ku oju ni be ra 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 ra. Consider it that certain countries, developed countries that they don't look their light at all. Now compare it to our, even Africa or in our country where there's pollution in the air and this air pollution is also causing a lot of sicknesses and ailments in our body. In our sight as but well. Can, can to? No matter how much anybody can what? help you. Ti ma na re ba ti ta ko en ti Olorun ni fun ni gba gba bayi. Adigba ti wo ka iwe mi mo. Wo. Ti ma na re le da o le je ni nla ko le se oni re bi ti Olorun. If it's cancer is contrary to that which God asked for you openly like this on the podium and even in the word of God one on one with you you see no matter how big the person is the cancer can never do good for you because but it cannot be compared to that of God see, we call smart it all. no matter how smart you are smartness smartness can never give you a good future like the Lord God your creator there is also a kind of guilt in the hand of it if you have a confidence that you always rely upon on to receive counsel, you have heart to your Put your heart together to the Lord God. Your and his way is sweet. It's a way of peace for your soul. And his way is sweet and for your peace for your health. For your journey. For the future of your husband, your wife, your children. The counsel of God is perfect and good for his church, for his fold. The Lord will help you. Rise to your feet. Oh God, inspire me, revive me, and revive each member in this ministry all over the world. Revive part of our body and our work. My family. The family, you for my children, each one of them, take the control. Revive and inspire each of your word for us in this ministry. So that we can hear it, so that our heart can retain it, so that we can put it to our actions. Revive and inspire each of our prayers so that it can achieve its aim and purpose. Inspire our youth and our children so that we can have understanding, so that they can have understanding concerning worship, concerning their own life as well. Pour out 
the spirit that will help us to worship you and worship your holy name into our lives. Give us a powerful strength of living life. And our children, revive God. Revive all our children, our youth. Revive us all. Hey. Into the life of households that can watch the live streaming that are 